Hey YouTube, it's your girl Amiris, and today I am here to talk about my first experience at the Dominican. Now, before I get into it, by the looks of my hair, how y'all think it went? <laughs> I am here, y'all, to talk about it. The Dominicans is out here scamming the natural hair girls. Like, this was a scam. This was a scam. Pause the video if you're not already subscribed and go ahead and hit the subscribe button as well as the thumbs up button. Also, comment down below if you're a natural hair girl and you don't been scammed by the Dominicans. Like, this is ridiculous. So, like, oh, y'all, I just got done eating, so my pants is unzipped because sister need to breathe. But, y'all, let's get into it. So, the other day, I caught myself trying to do something, honey. I was like, let me go get my hair uh, trimmed and washed and give me a good little blowout honey with some curls honey cuz so it's just wanted a, a new look right now I ain't gonna lie when I got to the Dominican hair shop I was like oh this is perfect nobody in here I'm the only person here so I'm gonna get in the chair right away this shouldn't take too long okay so and I'm not gonna give up too much because the lady who did my hair, she took um, her time with it. She took her time with it. She washed it, deep conditioned, detangled, all that. And the whole way through, she just come, come on. Oh, I love your hair. Your hair's so beautiful. It's so strong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I get into the chair. Mind you, at this point, it's been about an hour and a half. No worries. I'm As long as you're going to slay me, honey, like I, I'm willing to give you two hours. Two and a half hours, it don't matter. You get to blow dry my hair and straighten my hair and everything. How you want it? You want curls or you want straight? Oh, let me get curls because I never had curls before, right? Okay, she finished my hair. And I loved it. I loved it. It was so pretty. It was bouncy. It was shiny. It was, it was giving me what it was supposed to give. So, I go home, y'all. And I'm like, oh, let me protect my hair. So, I seen the Dominican lady. Let me, let me give you an example of what she did. She was doing her own hair in the shop. So, I seen her flat iron it, put the curl in it, and then she took her fingers and did a little a, did a little motion like this, right? Wrapped it up, pinned it to secure it, right? So, I'm like, oh, okay, that's how they preserve it. So, I go home, and I'm wrapping my little hair, you know, pinning it up all the way around. Like, oh, I'm going to be slated in the morning. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, my cousin called me the next day like, oh, you want to go to Juicy Crab? So I'm like, yeah, I'll go to Juicy Crab or whatever. You know, I just got me a fresh little blowout. I'm thinking I'm going to stop and get my eyebrows done, you know, slave, whatever. Child, so mind you, I'm a bath girl anyway. I prefer baths over showers, but I knew that I couldn't get in the shower because, you know, the steam and the moisture getting into your hair. So I'm like, okay, let me take a lukewarm bath lukewarm again to prevent the steam and the moisture getting into my hair right take me a lukewarm bath and i'm getting dressed and then i'm like oh let me take my hair down and see what it's giving right why am i looking like dolly parton a black dolly parton it's it's not giving what it's supposed to give and i'm trying to understand how many times do you have to go to the dominicans for your hair to say slayed and laid like it is when you walk out the door. Like, there's no reason why I'm looking like this in less than 24 hours. Like, somebody got some explaining to do. Then I'm thinking about, I went and did all that research, looking at old Dominican hair shops near me, all the comments like, oh, I love such and such. She do a good job with my hair. Oh, I've been taking my daughter's hair for the past uh, such and such amount of years. And I'm thinking like, I ought to go back underneath every comment and put, you a lie. Use a lie and the truth ain't in you because, baby, the lies, the lies y'all tell, they need to put a disclaimer. Like, natural girls, this style is only going to last from the time you walk out the shop to the time you make it home. Don't worry about wrapping it up because in the morning it ain't going to look nothing like it did when I got finished with you when you got up out my chair. Like, let's talk about it. Eight, $80 dollars to a hundred and something dollars for you to wake up the next day and your hair looking like this even though you took all the proper precautions on how to protect your hair and this this is what i get let me show y'all the back i don't know if i can show y'all the back because 
Okay, I'm gonna see. I might have to crop it, but just, just get into it. I mean, to me, it don't look like I drove past a Dominican shop, let alone sat down in somebody's chair and got my hair blowed out and straightened. Like, that that's a scam. It's a scam to me, honey. Like, this is not giving what it's supposed to engage. And I just want, I just want to know, how is this possible? How? Like, if that's the case, you need to let me know, like, baby, are you sure you want to give me your coins because your hair is not gonna look like how it looks when I get finished when you wake up tomorrow. Is it that hard like to tell people like, baby, this is a waste of money unless you going and wearing it out tonight, unless you got somewhere that you put, wanna go tonight, you, this hairstyle's only gonna last you for tonight, honey. You need to go ahead and do everything that you're gonna do. Show everybody that you wanna show. Take all the pictures that you wanna take tonight. Cause when you get up in the morning, honey, you're gonna be looking like Dolly Parton, period. But this is just a little rant video, y'all. Mm. Look at me, God, I don't like ugly. But yeah, y'all, I just had to come and do a little rant because there's no reason why I should be looking like this when I just sat in, in somebody's chair for three hours the other day getting my hair done. like. I could have did this at home myself. But yeah, so comment down below if you are a natural hair girl and you ever went to the, the Dominicans and woke up the next day looking like a black Dolly Parton. It's, it's not giving. It's simply not giving. And they will not get another dime of my money. But that's it, y'all. That's all I wanted to talk about. I really wanted to rant about how I feel like the Dominican um, hair salons are scams. They are not for black girls. With natural hair, I should say. They're not for black girls with natural hair. Comment down below your opinion if you ever experienced going to a Dominican hair salon. But yes, that is it for this video, y'all. Thank y'all so much for listening to my rant. I'm highly upset that I basically gotta either put my hair in a ponytail or try to re-flat iron it myself after I already paid somebody to do my hair. But yes, again, y'all, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I'm going to see y'all in the next one.